okay, got it done. But the one thing I can tell you guys about fitness, it's not easy every day. Because some days I don't feel fired up every day. But I always let it play out in my mind that if I'm not doing something, then I'm actually cheating myself out of, you know, just quality life. But you got to pick your days and your times when you train. You have to mix the exercises up. And uh, you got to have a, a large variety of healthy foods to eat. And like every now and then sprinkle some, I guess you can sprinkle some junk food in there every now and then. Um, but 90% of what you eat should be something that your body can use with a lot of, you know, dense macronutrients. It's, again, you know, like this morning, I feel kind of sluggish, but I still got in there and I did, I did something. Um, and a lot of that plays into me always being active and training, training other people and getting other people together and uh, writing and getting the books and stuff ready. Not easy all the time. A lot of, lot of mental wear and tear, but that's cool because again, it makes me stronger for the course. And you live to get stronger. I guess for breakfast, I may make myself a salad, a nice salad and uh, some water to recharge and re re rehydrate and rejuvenate the system. Stretch, make sure that the limbs and everything is loose and limber. Take care of the body like you're supposed to. I mean, good health is definitely a gift because again, I know people that can't walk, they can't move, they can't breathe properly. They got a lot of things going on. So I, I never take I never take a moment like that for granted because I understand. And you got to get out early. For me, early the better. That way, my the rest of the day is mine. And with what's going on now, you know, you got plenty of time to get it together. You know, enough with the excuses. You know, I'm looking at the health, I'm looking at the longevity of the individual, myself, and anybody that I train, I always try to stress stress that. Because losing the weight once you get it, that's the easy part. Maintaining that level of fitness after you get the weight off, that's the tough part. But it can be done. It's not impossible. It's totally up to the individual. And you gotta push yourself, you gotta try. You can't be comfortable, you can't try to be comfortable. You really don't want comfort. Because when you're training and you're getting your body physically fit, you're really preparing it for uh, activities that you may do outside of the outside of uh, normal life. Your reflexes become sharper. Your body weight, once your body weight is uh, down, you just become better for the course. You know, a lot of people will complain about, you know, have you seen those people that are heavy and they're either too hot or too cold? Well, that's your body telling you right there, right there, that body a lot of body fat obesity messes with your body's natural ability to regulate heat whether to you know to heat you up or cool you down especially cooling you down so you don't benefit from a lot you don't benefit from being obese it's strictly health issues and it's not fat shaming people can say whatever they want to say because it makes them feel good it's cosmetically pleasing to to uh, have people say that to you but you think about it. You know people like that. Or you've seen people like that. You try to figure out why is this person, you know, going through all these issues with their, you know, with the, it's too hot or too cold. Well, there's one of the reasons right there. You got to be good to your body so your body can be good to you. And then, like I said, again, you pass it on to the next generation because the youth need to understand what's going on. And that's what, you know, I love talking to the young folk about fitness and, you know, of, amongst other things that's going to make them, you know, more beneficial out here in society. So, do your part, man. Do your part. Be an example. Be an inspiration. Inspire people. And hopefully I've done that this morning and I've inspired people to be the best versions of themselves they can possibly be and inspire people. So, this has been L.A. Kendrick with the fitness tip and the fitness work for the morning. Y'all be safe, y'all be healthy out there. Cause I've just brought you the heavy.